if you don't want to commit a file into the git repository it makes sense not to have it show up in the staging area in the first place so you don't accidentally commit the file to prevent a file from showing up in the staging area you use a git ignore file let's go through an example of how that will look like in practice in this window i've opened up the project and what i'm going to do right now is to install a file uh, what i'm going to do is to install a library called typey after installing the library you can see that there's a node modules folder in the node modules folder there is the folder called typey which we have installed followed by all the files that are installed along with typey and if you go back to fork into the staging area you see a lot of files that go into your staging area now this is what we said earlier in the previous video that you should not include libraries that you installed with package managers like npm because it adds a lot of files into your git history and it kind of pollutes your repository if you don't add any of these libraries from the package manager into your git repository the easy way is to create a git ignore file let's do that so we go back to our code editor and then we'll create a file inside the root directory the file name is dot git ignore so dot g i t i g n o r e in this git ignore file you write down the files and folders that you don't want to see in the git repository so if you want to exclude the file you can say um, the file name itself if you want to exclude a folder you can also write the folder name so in this case we are we want to exclude the node modules folder so what we do is write node modules which is the name of this folder save it and then if you go back to fault you see that the node modules folder has been removed from the staging area entirely and what you have to do is to commit the git ignore file along with the yeah so what you have to do is to commit the git ignore file to save that end 